Hello, beautiful people. How are you all doing? There are certain secrets that other relationship counselors might not tell you. Yes, this secret is that there are consequences for knocking before marriage. Yes, a lot of people don't know about this. I've counseled people. I counsel people every day and I listen to them and a lot of people are ignorant. So I'm here to enlighten you all. Let me tell you something. You can't deceive God. You can't fool God and just get away with it. Yes, our God is merciful, but so long you disobey him, there are consequences for disobedience. Remember the story of Adam and Eve? They disobeyed God and you know what happened. So if you think you can go against God's will and knock before marriage and think there are no consequences, they are. So I'm here to enlighten you. Please don't forget to share this video. Give this video a thumbs up and drop a comment. I want to find out what you think, okay? Number one consequences of knocking before marriage is single mother, single father, baby mama, baby dada. Excuse me, I'm just joking. But I'm very serious. Many women can testify to the fact that they met a man, the man loved them, he promised them marriage, he said they should get pregnant. They stayed there, they were born one. Some of them born two, born three, born four. Till now, that man has not married them. In the end, didn't you turn to single mother? Yes, the reason why you have turned to single mother is because you have disobeyed God. I'm telling you, people are ignorant. So long you disobey God, there are consequences for disobedience. And if you obey God, there are rewards and blessings that come with it. So if you think you can actually knock before marriage and think it's a normal thing, it's not a normal thing. You have to pay for it one way or the other. So some of the consequences of knocking before marriage is single mom, single dad. Okay? A lot of people have contacted me that they met this man, they are pregnant, they've given birth to two children. Till now, that man has not married them. And that man will go and toast another girl and say he's not married. And of course, he's not married. And many a times, we women are the ones at the receiving end. I'm not trying to say it doesn't affect the men, but it affects us more. So women, close your legs until marriage. Guard yourself, okay? All right. Consequence number two. Let me tell you how it affects men. If you are a man and you are watching right now, and you are knocking different girls, just knocking them, you're thinking that, yes, you are a man. Let me tell you how it affects you as a man. Loneliness. Yes, you will be lonely because you have sold seats already and it's counting when god wants to serve you breakfast it should be like this boza at your older age when you think you're supposed to have your family around you that is when you'll be lonely i've met a man at the age of 49 almost 50. this man he told me that he regrets knocking different girls when he was young he thought he was a playboy a fine boy when god wanted to serve him breakfast He's alone. He stays alone. He eats alone. And he doesn't have a family because of what he was doing. So if you're a man, you think you can, you're a man. You can be knocking different girls. When you get old, you will meet it. So please avoid knocking. If you meet a girl, you like her, settle down, okay? So that when you get old, you can have a family or some people to spend time with, all right? <clears throat> consequence number three. Another consequence of knocking before marriage is sexually transmitted diseases. Why would you want to endanger your lives, endanger your health? Because you cannot simply be obedient to God. Many men and women are down with incurable diseases today because of knocking, okay? So sexually transmitted diseases, even unwanted pregnancies, you're not ready to become a mother and because you disobey God, now you're a single mom unwanted pregnancy so stay away from it all right <clears throat> consequence number four spiritually transmitted diseases whether you like it or not knocking is more spiritual than physical some of you men watching right now you can testify to the fact that it was where you started knocking that girl that's when your business went down it was where you started knocking that girl that's when your money went down the reason why is that is that once you knock people you become one with them Whatever those people are carrying, you too, you will carry. Some of these women and men you see on the street, some of them, they have spirit of stagnation, financial cause, marital cause, and you go and knock them, even if you say you're using protection. 
you become one with them whatever they are carrying in their bloodline you to inherit it okay so stay away from knocking there are consequences and that's what i'm spilling out to you people right now all right <clears throat> number five divorce yes 90 percent of the divorce cases we are experiencing today is as a result of knocking before marriage let me tell you how this works you can't mock God. You can't deceive God. Whatever is so today, you will reap tomorrow. If you think you can be knocking that woman and eventually get married to her, it's just by the grace of God that your marriage will last. Why? Because the foundation of the marriage is already weak. It's weak already. You have disobeyed God. God said, do not knock until you are married. I'm not trying to say there's any perfect relationship. Maybe you made a mistake with your fiancé. But correct yourself correct yourself don't keep doing it all right so many divorces divorce cases out there as a result of the foundation of the marriage they are disobeyed god before they got married so once they get married those seeds of disobedience they have created some years back will come and meet them in front that is what they call karma disobedience to god although our god is a very merciful god but please stay away from it okay all right finally consequence number six is marital delay yes some people's marriages have been delayed as a result of knocking before marriage if you are knocking a man or a woman or which god has not ordained to be the right person for you it will delay you from meeting the right person yes if you are knocking a woman that woman some people are not your husband some people are not your wife so your wife is out there looking for you. But because you are busy knocking the wrong person, you have bonded with that person and you don't want to leave. That's what they call so time. It will now delay you from meeting the right person that God has prepared for you. So I hope this video has blessed you. Okay? Please, if you are if it's a weakness, ask God to help you. This is what a lot of people don't know. Whatever you sow today, you will reap tomorrow. Our God is merciful, yes. But remember, it's a just God. Ask God for the grace so that you can do what is right. And don't sow seeds that will still come and hurt you tomorrow. Share this video so that many people out there can learn. God bless you. Bye.